Well, that was shit. He's cack handed as Johnny. I've said to him before, I said. Cack handed Johnny. Never bloody listens. Glad he's not my lad. Not easy this sport, I'll give them that. Got to put the practice in. It's not the kind of sport you can take up lightly, you know, like darts or rugby. This is not a game of skill, but of endurance and in incredible skill. And I know what I'm talking about. I know my sport. I used to play football. Back in the day, actually. Yeah. Sunday League. I wasn't exactly John Barnes, but I tried my hardest always. <laughs> Those were the days. There was a big social scene back then, of course, you know. Disco, girls, sometimes. Stella Artois. <laughs> Good boy! Nice attempt, Matthew! Good lad. Yeah, <laughs> right, Matthew, here we go. Past the challenge. High carb, high speed. I don't want any dawdling like last time. It was watching a I do push him. But pushing people is the only way they'll learn to do things on their own. Are you ready? On your marks. Get set. Go! Go, Matthew, go! No hesitation. We can't have hesitation at the start. More than one, that's it. Two pieces of pasta. Good boy. No, Matthew! Do I push him too hard? No. In fact, if I had my way, he'd be homeschooled. Then we'd see. When I say go, you go. One, two, three, and go! Being the best at everything isn't important, but trying to be is. That's what my dad should have told me. Mushroom lads. Uh, we've been part of this team for uh, two years now, and it's a great way for me to just, you know, spend time with the boy, father and son, and the other guys, man to man. Blue ball, blue ball, blue ball, blue ball, blue ball, blue ball. Come on, Eddie. That's more like it. It's a national sport. This people are at it up and down the country these days, and and we're getting involved wherever we can. <laughs> you know, I follow the team, helping David. Sorry, coach. <laughs> With driving, support, sometimes tactics. Yeah, I think they see me as indispensable. <laughs> None of the other parents are permanent fixtures. They come and go, you know. Drop them off, pick them up like it's a bloody crash or something. Oh, for <laughs> sake! If in doubt, pass it out to Matthew. Pass it to Matthew. Look. He's in space, Matthew wants it! Oh, <laughs> Matthew, you <laughs> useless <laughs> twit! Sorry, David. Coach. <laughs> Coach Dickhead. They know me here, used to me by now. I'm treated like, well, not royalty, not a celebrity as such, more like a celebrity's dad, like the Queen Mum. Excuse me. Oi, excuse me, what are you doing? Where are you going? Oh, here we go, Jimmy Jobsworth. What do you want, Jimmy? My name's Gary. Yeah, I know. Jimmy Jobsworth. <laughs> Works, doesn't it? But I've just said it. Where are you going with the camera and that? Oh, just back to the changing rooms. What? Changing rooms. Well, that's not... Well, you obviously can't take a camera 
into changing rooms, can you? What? You obviously cannot take a camera without permission into a place where people are dressing and undressing. Obviously. This might be on the telly. Yes, exactly. Exactly. Oh, for f sake! OK, fine, we will wait for him here. Sorry. Political correctness gone mad. Excuse me, someone seems to have done a poo in the swimming pool. <sighs> Again? Come on. It wasn't me. Ah, oh, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> the coast is clear. <laughs> Follow me. Hands off cocks, on with socks. Shit, shit, women. No, no, this isn't what you think. What are you doing? Look, I wasn't looking at all four. I, I, I was not filming that. I, I accidentally. Look, I didn't see a single boob. Not one. I, I think it's time you left, mate. Look, get that shitty spoon off me. Look, get that f off me. It's a good pool, this, to be fair. One of my faves. Look at that water. Azure. And it's one of the few you're not banned from, isn't it, Nigel? King! Oh, just saying. Yeah. After last week and the whole changing room... Uh... Oh. Uh, hey, do you, think, uh, do you think Matthew's going to be off the bench today? I heard Andrew's got a massive Veruca, so that's promising, isn't it? Anyone want a coffee? <laughs> Nigel? Just leave it, King. Knows nothing. Idiot. Don't just make Andrew put a bloody sock on. Anything but let Matthew get into the pool, show them all up. Makes me sick. Excuse me, Emily, where do you think you're going? Toilet. I don't think so, young lady. Look at the time. The match starts in 20 minutes. The lads will be warming up any second now. Daddy does not want any distractions. Just hold it till half time. There's a good girl. Just sit still and draw another painting or something. Babysitting again today. She's off seeing the mother. Not very well. I'd go myself, but... <laughs> no reason Madam can't go and see her granny, though, is there? Beyond me. Hospitals can be lovely for the little ones. So, Matthew's got two supporters today, eh, Emily? Nothing doesn't give a shit. A machine didn't have any coffee, can you believe it? So I went for the tea, pressed the button and uh, they, they'd run out of that too. I had to get vegetable soup, look. Oh, it stinks, Ken! <laughs> what a cheerleader today then, eh? Yes. <laughs> and what are we up to here? Drawing a little picture then, are we? Oh. Have you drawn this yourself? Well, this is... Nigel, have you seen this? It's brilliant. Oh, look, here we go. The lads are coming out now. Go on, Matthew. Come on, my son. Show them who's boss. Bench again. I've got an awful lot of faith in Matthew. Does he get the opportunities he deserves? No. Has the coach got it in for him? Well, <laughs> my lips are sealed. But, let me put it this way. I think he has. There's always room for improvement. That's how I see it. 
especially with Matthew. He's not a naturally talented kid at the end of the day. We've had more than our fair share of letdowns and disappointments and crushing embarrassments. But we crack on.